Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Would someone please answer me? I'm ringing right now. All is dead. Would someone please answer me? I'm ringing right now. All is dead. Would someone please answer me? This is Chris. Hey, Chris, it's Kat. Hey, Kat. I'm not going to kick you, I promise. Oh, thanks. I actually have a question for once. Oh. This is a tough one, though. I don't know if you can do this one. Oh, boy. Um, my do my 18-year-old got a laptop today. Oh. Regular Windows XP. It's a Dell 9400 Inspiron, I believe. Okay. There's only one user account, the main administrator account, on it. All right. She set up a password on that and then promptly forgot the password. Yeah. Uh... Is there any way to get her back in short of reinstalling everything? I believe possibly through uh, wireless packet says he can help. Um, I'm trying to remember. Um, there it may be either a recovery console or Winternals may have a. Apparently, there I know there are utilities. I didn't know that that would be uh, necessary, but uh, apparently Winternals has got something. Mark is suggesting to reinstall Windows if it's fresh. Which it is, um, but I, I'm right. so I'm kind of tossed up in between those two answers. You can either reinstall Windows, start from scratch, uh, or um, just uh, uh, is it boot it's safe mode? I don't know if safe mode's gonna do it, um, but uh, it looks like a Wireless Packet was recommending a Win Internals software, Win Internals software, um, to actually crack the password or, or find discover the password. That's the one thing, um, is you'd almost have to have That's a crack. That's I figured. I, I didn't know of any way to do it myself, and I figured, thought maybe somebody might, so. Uh, well, I've never really <laughs> run into that problem before, but I know that, that other people certainly have. Um, but right. since, yeah, see, that, that's the thing. Since, and I, I'm, I guess I'm going to be, I'm going to side on, on uh, or with Mark here, and just say that if you just got the machine and you didn't really do anything with it, uh, you might as well. Well, just I did. I already installed everything that she needed and all of that good stuff. That's why I didn't want uh, to. Oh, you're I killing had. me! All right, fine. Um, so hang on. Well, <laughs> wire, wireless packet. What you you were saying? Wind tunnels apparently has a program here, and Microsoft just recently acquired uh, that. I can, I can hear you like typing away furiously, but I don't know which particular utility. Um, oh, a live boot CD. Okay. So apparently there's a utility um, inside uh, the boot CD uh, that would allow you to recover or and or erase and, and restart. Uh, Sam Inside from InsidePro.com is what Mark just recommended. Um, designed to recover passwords. See, now this is the... This is the thing that, that kind of freaks me out about recommending this, and this is why I, I was kind of tossed up. I know. You know why. I mean, because obviously someone can yep, see this, and they exactly. can use it for nefarious purposes. But I think, uh, you know, you, you, obviously you're legit. Cat, by the way, is the person who helps re-encode the videos and put them on YouTube. Uh, very grateful for that. Um, okay, so here, here, this one. So you got Winternals has got the live boot CD. Uh, you could reinstall Windows or... Looks like this one's pretty powerful. InsidePro.com, a program called Sam Inside. Um, yeah, and there right now it looks like it might work. But it's not. This one I don't think is free, but it looks like it's pretty darn powerful. And I, I know why it's. I, I'm pretty sure I know why it's not free. Um, yeah. The uh, uh, try and I don't know if the live CD is or not. I don't know the license for that. Um, or use Linux? No, Nivius. I, I don't think that's the solution to the problem. Um, no. Emergency boot CD is free. Well, it may be free, but... Uh, okay, here's here's another one. An open source project. Uh, uh, off, off crack or off crack? O-P-H crack? Windows password cracker based on uh, train off rainbow tables. The only issue is uh, with this... Okay, it looks like it's uh, uh, it's on. It's a Linux utility. 
dumping hashes from a Windows partition. So that's a uh, wow. Yeah, that that may be a little deep for you. Try the uh, yes. Yeah, try the uh, try either Salmon's side or uh, well, Scoob is recommending Winternals as well. Um, so yeah, go with the Winternal software, the live boot CD. Go that route. Mark Mark Rasinovich is a really good guy. Uh, he knows his stuff. He's got good utilities too, free utilities. I see that. So. Since I'm not gonna say you're cool. Okay. <laughs> I think you just did. I know. I had to give him that because he waited so I could call. <laughs> so I appreciate that a lot. Oh, it looks like Life Hackers got uh, a category software for password recovery. That's very very cool. So now, anybody who's oh, listening or watching this... That too. Thanks, everybody. I appreciate it. Well, yeah, it's no problem. I mean, I, like I said, I'm really cautious about rec making any serious recommendations just because I know that they can be used for... Uh, and, but this, I mean, this is the whole problem is w with passwords is they, they can be cracked. So, exactly. you, you know, it's like... <laughs> that's why I really don't put that much um, belief... Uh, or you know that much confidence inside of of any operating system password, um, especially one that can be easily e e cracked easily enough that three different people have recommended three different products for you to try to use to break through. I don't know. I, it's it, I don't know. I think more than anything, it's going to stop someone, the average person. If someone really wants to get into something, they're going to get into it. Uh, and next time, make sure they either write it down or don't or let you set all the passwords. I'm going to make her tell me she was only trying to lock her 12-year-old sister out, so. <laughs> you know, the 12-year-old sister probably could have figured this out, too, I'd imagine. Probably, because you know what? I think she's about to surpass myself as far as geekiness goes, so. It's kind of how it's, she, She's pretty good. It, yeah, usually, uh, it, usually uh, it goes that way. You impart knowledge and wisdom through osmosis. Yep. We'll pass down the MVP. She can have it next. <laughs> there you go. All right, cool, cat. Hey, thanks, Chris. Take thanks, care. everybody.